again. Uh, I'm back here at Mutesa Royal University at this education monument. We call it education monument. Yeah. Bia Kusoma Vetulimu. So indeed, one normal side. The number is a coco. Really, not to me by then. I catch for a cigar. Neka teach for a chibumbe chafe. Chow with day. Chow with drums. I'm sorry this time to get mixing a muko kuzungu no Uganda. Kuba mune tu agara chini chini international tu agara sewo tu benga na wala bachi kola chi. Exactly. In gabatu funa ichi tuli ko. Sebo we yangule. Ah, by names I'm Wamala Elias. Yes. Wamala Elias. Your what is your occupation? My occupation. I'm a sculptor. Yeah. Wamala Elias is a sculptor. Uh, for those of you who are watching us, I want to tell you that um, I've made a video about this sculpture and this is the man behind it. I'll be, uh, when, uh, I'll be showing you from the last uh, video we, we, we recorded, I'll be showing you what this gentleman was doing. So I have that clip, I'll, 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 I'll at least bring for you what transpired during that time when he was still working on this sculpture. So Elias. Uh, we are seeing that this sculpture was um, the monument was unveiled by His Grace Archbishop Posemogedede on the 9th of November 2023, and it was sculpted by Wamara Elias, the person here. So, could you please take us through of what? Uh, why did you? Why did you decide to do? This type of work. Okay, first, what impressed me yeah. was uh, the school compound and the, the students' life at the campus. Yeah, that inspired me, man. That's the reason why you see the sculpture is dominated with several books. Yeah, several books around it. Yes, I have uh, genetics, then you have economics and other more books at okay. the campus. So that inspired me to do this sculpture. Mm. Yes. So you decided to put this kind of books, genetics, economics. Why? Why not other 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 books? Why did you decide to put uh, genetics? I'm seeing genetics here, and I'm also seeing economics. Why economics? Is, is it because they are they are they are they are found in every in every department? I would say exactly. The economics it is uh, like uh, a key book because in the art also we do economics. Okay. We have uh, that is uh, area where we do accounts. What it is a business. Okay. Uh, it is a business. So it so, applies in every uh -huh. in That's every aspect. Mm. I decided, decided to use to economics use and genetics. And genetics. Yes. Okay. I'm seeing a gentleman here in boots, well decorated, in a sweater. Uh, like guys, you are, you, are, you are seeing. Why did you say that these people should be holding a book? It's all about education. Like the way how we started the, at first, it is education monument. What brings education? It is that book. Mm. And also we have pen around. You have there yeah. is a pen. I see yeah. a pen here. Uh -huh. Let me take it's two. It's all about education. Those mm. are some uh, objects we use in education. Okay. So, yes. That's the reason why I decided to use. Uh, that book instead of a <laughs> light or any okay. other object. Yes. Just that you didn't me you, you didn't uh, <laughs> you didn't ask which book is this. Yeah. At least it, it would be, be it would be uh, some may, maybe microeconomics yeah, or macro, uh, but you didn't or, you didn't or indicate. History, or encyclopedia. Uh, yeah, encyclopedia <laughs> would be the best by yes. the way. Hmm. So we are seeing a lady. So could you describe the lady as well? The lady uh, was a student of Homotesa. Then it was a great friend to me. That's why I decided to use that lady to pose for that is capture, and then I took those captions. Uh, I have the two D captions where I developed that uh, inspiration, and then I developed it uh, into three D uh, around this capture, like mm. the way how you see. This mm. is around this capture. Mm. Mm. Uh, that is already uh -huh. now. Maybe you have another question concerning that is the, that is the lady. Mm. So and the gentleman is you. <laughs> Why me? Could we say because I'm seeing you are the likeness? Uh, the likeness. Yeah. 
So what inspired you to do this? Because you, you've told us that the the campus was, you know, according to the environment, we didn't have anything like this. And then the students' life. So you you, you mixed up the uh, the the campus life, the yes. university life, and then the students' life. Exactly. If I may ask, why did why didn't you do a sculpture of maybe entertainment? You know, why not entertainment? Why? Why this? It my inspiration, entertainment. Mm. But it's also, this sculpture entertains. Because the environment, now it is a talking environment where we are now, mm. it entertains. So oh. it plays to growth, academics, and also it entertains. It so, brings out the message. Mm. So now, if, if I ask, um, uh, if, if I'm to ask, if someone comes out and say, could you briefly could you briefly tell us that how much could it have costed you? How much? In a brief, you may not be, you, you may not be, ex with the exact exact fi figures, but yes. at least you can tell us at least estimates. around yeah, yes. estimates. It can. Uh, that sculpture, actually, I used like uh, five point five. You spent you spent 5.5 m yes doing that time uh, provided i had some materials just around at the campus mm. that's the reason why i used that little money to construct that okay. but if at all i didn't have that material i would have used more money than that material then mm. for how long eh? for how long have you did you do this sculpture how long did it take you to, I, to finalize with this sculpture actually i took like one year to finalize it one year so you didn't find any difficulties? Uh, financial issues. It was only the, the only problem. Mm. So if I thought it wasn't financial, mm. it would take you how, for how long? Like uh, six months to be done. Six months? Yes. So could you give people your number again? Because some people might be there mm. and they would like to, you know, to have such sculptures, maybe at their buildings, uh, hotels, uh, you know. Okay, my telephone number? Zero seven five six nine six six four nine four. Repeat it again. Zero seven five mm. six nine mm. six six four nine four. Okay, for those of you who are watching this video, uh, I will recommend you. I think I will put uh, a link to the first video we made when when I found this gentleman uh, finalizing with this uh, monument. It was it wasn't looking like this. Exactly. So now, what kind of color? What kind of makeup? What kind of uh, <laughs> did you use? So that okay, someone I used should the bronze. That is the final finishing. Bronze. Bronze. Yes. yes. Uh, no, it is waterproof. Waterproof. Exactly. Uh, so how much? If if I want, how much is a bronze? Is it is it weighed? Is it in 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 a, in a spray format? Is it in a, in, a, in a tin? It is in tin. Liters. It is in, it so, is in liters. Eh? Yes. So how much could be a liter? A liter costs around ten. It costs around hundred thousand. One hundred thousand. Yes. Okay. So, what 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 feedbacks did you get after uh, the Archbishop uh, launching this this monument? Okay, the appreciation, uh -huh. the, uh, people appreciated mm. my work, that mm. it is uh, so wonderful, nice, I got uh, comments, mm. uh, and also I got some uh, customers, then uh, I got uh, advice still from mm. my fellow artists mm. on this work, mm. and the work looked so nice, Okay, yes, and they appreciated that work. Mm. Yes. So, have you yet got some... Some some people calling you that they wanted to do such sculptures maybe at there. Yes. Have you got? I got some. There's a, a certain guy who called me, and then he told me, okay, he was inspired by this composition. Yeah. And then he told me uh, he will keep in touch with me. Mm. Yes. So I also dedicate this uh, this video to Lion King. I think Lion King is located in. Uh, Right now is uh, is in Sydney. You saw this uh, sculpture, and then you told me to go back and shoot again to see how the finished work would be. So I dedicate this video to you. Hope you hope you are watching now. <laughs> I know you you you'll comment, and I, and I think he 
he he contacted you as well exactly yeah mm -hmm. so lion king we are, we thank you that you are watching our videos as well so uh, this said so this is uh wamara areas he does sculptures by the way tell them that you don't you don't only do only I, this one i don't only do sculptures but also i do interior designing interior designing i do painting there's the other thing you told uh, me last time gypsum in gypsum is yes, it gypsum do gypsum ceilings so for those of you well. who don't know gypsum i think you could tell you again mm. the gypsum because uh, we always see them mm. in in hotels okay. people's uh, people's houses but you may not know what mm. gypsum mean mm. could you please explain them how uh, gypsum it is a type of ceiling mm. but uh, we use lights spotlights uh we use uh, plain lights you have we use uh plain lights spotlights and the speed lights okay uh it looks so amazing when you use it and uh, it gives light to the entire mm. uh, interior yeah it is like a, it is uh, not like the ordinary ones without lights but uh, we use boards and then lights okay yeah. as we are about to end this video eh, would you recommend your would you recommend someone to go for sculpting yeah i recommend the artist to go for sculpture not only in cement, but also you can go for other materials. You have fiberglass, you have wood, you have metal casting. You can cast it and then you come out with uh, such works. Mm. Yes. So, like, I would, I would, I would ask again, uh, how, have you ever done uh, like any other? Because people, new people would, would, would may, may, may need to know mm. whether I've done, you. So far, I've done sculptures in wood, wooden sculptures for oh. uh, churches. Mm. I've done sculptures in clay, mm. I've done sculptures in cement, mm. I've renovated some sculptures in mm. uh, Eastern Uganda, mm. particularly Kalilo, NTC. Mm. Yes. So you, are, so you can also renovate as well? As well, I can renovate. Ah, so if you're, if you're going to renovate, do you follow the... The work you found, or you can also recreate again your <laughs> own, or you have to follow that which one. Because, for example, yes. someone might have been with uh, with an idea mm. of 1970s, mm -hmm. but now things have changed, my mm. friend. Uh, now, if you decide, uh, if you sit down as a panel, then you decide that I should uh, change somewhere, I can do it. But if you are told you want the same sculpture, mm. I can do it also. It depends on what you want. Then, for me, my role is to produce, to do, or to bring an, a new look. Okay. Yes. So your last words uh, about this monument, uh, and we call it a day. Okay. My last words. Mm. Uh, it goes to students. Whoever do sculpture or any artworks, in every angle, you do artworks and then you insist on that work and produce the quality from your best mm. yes that is the dedication to all artists so you advise them to to make sure but the problem is i don't know i don't know whether it's the same but mm. when talk about those guys doing furniture mm. they take long to submit you pay them you give them money earlier but uh, Giving you your finished work is a problem. I don't. Mm. I don't think whether it is the same this side. Uh, <laughs> you know they say birds of it, it, birds of the same feather flock together. Uh, ah, so sculpting. I'm I'm, I'm 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 feeling like mm. people doing furniture are also mm. sculpting. Mm. So birds of the same feather mm. flock together. Aren't we the same people? Ah uh, no 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 no. We give you our money. Yes. Create for us something like this and this. Mm. Then it takes you ages, mm. and then we start looking for you. Your phones are on and off. Mm. So aren't we the same now? When you are starting, when you are getting a contract, mm. you have some uh, forms where you sign those mm. forms, then you, you make sure that uh, uh, this and this time we are going to do this work will reach a uh, uh, certain it, level. So you are talking, about, you are talking going, about the time period. Uh, the time period. So you have to sit down and know uh -huh. the time period, the From time period you are going to work. up to the, the following day, this work will look like this. Then you, oh. give, you keep on giving so, out the progress of your work. Okay. Yes. But for, for those who are dealing with furniture, maybe you go there, you press your order, and then you move away. You don't sign. So with this type of work you're doing, you, you, you are working on timeline? Uh -huh. timeline. Okay. Hello, guys. Uh, I'm with a gentleman here. Nice to, to be with him. 
I'm so glad that at least uh, he was able to give us a feel of, of, of his work. So I'm very happy. I will be very happy. The good thing. In the first video, he gave out his number. Even in this video, he gave out his number. You can reach him kindly if you have any 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 job. He's doing various. At least you can you can call him and say hi. At least yeah. that you saw him from my channel. Yes. I will be I will, I will be very happy. So you can give him work, jobs, and other thing. But the best thing would be contact him. Contact him so that you should get to know more. About, about him. He does wonderful work. Personally, I've seen her work. Uh, the wood carvings, I, at least I saw some of your wood carvings mm. sometime back, at least that one I know. Like in the other last video, he told us that <laughs> he's a briefcase man. His office is, is in a briefcase, so he's always, he's always <laughs> moving. So maybe when he gets money, he might find uh, you know a place. But all, he'll get that after you guys giving him work to do. So but you can still move around and this the back part of like Yeah, I'm going to show them. I'm going to show, by the I'm going to show you how this uh this this monument is looking. Uh, because that time I showed you they are still finalizing with it. So I'm going to show you now. Just enjoy the video right now. Thank you. Don't forget by the way to subscribe. Don't forget to like. Don't don't forget to comment by the way. Ca guys kindly comment. And if you like, just hit the subscription button and you know, you enjoy the amazing videos that we, we always give out to you guys. Let me show you, let me take you around and watch this exciting monu education monument. Thank you.